How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. Today we're looking at some creepy videos that were found on Reddit. So hit that subscribe button and get ready for more scary content just like this. In this chilling video uploaded by YouTube user Hellsinger85, we hear what appears to be a voicemail from a stranger in a harried and strained voice. Man tells the video's uploader to stay away from him, going so far as to say, if I come to the door, don't answer it. The uploader claims that he received this voicemail on an unsolicited CD in the mail from someone called John Colbert. He has no idea who the sender is or what the voicemail pertains to. Although the message breaks up, the follow-up statement is clear. It's not me, it won't be me, the voice says, before letting out what appears to be screams of pain. He can feel it, the man says, before letting out further screams of agony. Most chilling of all, after going silent for a moment, the man lets out what seems to be a diabolical laugh. Kaylee, he says, before the message cuts off. The video uploader said that a note came with the CD, stating, You're on the right trail. You may wish to get off the trail while you can. How this voicemail passed through all of these hands with so little explanation is worrisome, and the implications are even creepier. Who is Kaylee? Without any confirmation, we have no way of knowing if any of the voicemail recipients ended up alright, or if they were perhaps ambushed by some sinister force. There is little more creepy than a disembodied mask giving out vague information in a dark room. That's exactly what happens in this, one of the most creepy videos ever uploaded to YouTube by user Jay Alley. In the video, a lone figure in a white mask in a dark room appears to be speaking at barely above a whisper. Without preamble or introduction, the voice gets into delivering its message, a seemingly random set of coordinates. Four, nine, five, nine, three, four. Is the figure being held against its will? Does it want us to find it? Or is there perhaps a more sinister reason behind it wearing the mask? Three, six, the video's title is perhaps the exact date and time it was uploaded, 8.56, December 26th, and the video's description gives us an equally vague message. It's opening, see you there Thomas, ave at quay vale, with the latter phrase meaning hail and farewell. One commenter said this, if these are coordinates it leads to some woods by an unnamed road in the middle of nowhere in Summerlin, British Columbia, Canada. Maybe there was a drug deal or some trade at this location on the said date and time. A drug deal or perhaps something more sinister. Creepy and nondescript woods have been the scene of many a more heinous act. The line about something opening and all of the intrigue surrounding the video seems to suggest something much worse is at play. What? What? Nine? Nine? Five? In another one of the most creepy videos on the internet, this dashcam video uploaded by Ivan Tuckton depicts something inexplicable. While driving along the street at night, Tuckton happens upon what is supposedly a roadblock. Oh, what the f dude? Given the late hour and the video quality, all the viewer is able to see are a few cones in the middle of the road, what appears to have been a car pulled over, and a man wearing jeans walking over to the vehicle. Immediately, the viewer gets the sense that something's wrong. If this were a routine roadblock, would the officer really be dressed in jeans? Why had the officer approached the uploader's vehicle in this way? What's going on? Can I help you with something? Yes. 
The uploader adds in captions describing the exact moment when the supposed officer was supposed to have reached into his pocket, evidently setting off further alarms in the driver's head, causing him to speed away. What is perhaps most eerie about this video is that the uploader claims the local police claim the instigators were arrested on DUI charges. While the perpetrators may very well have been drunk and decided to set up this roadblock, one can't quite believe that they mean to put on a simple well-intentioned prank and not commit some more heinous act. What was the figure reaching into his pocket for and could it possibly have been for anything good? One thing's for sure, we're glad that the driver got out of there while he could. This grainy footage harkens back to the found footage horror movie days of old. Creepily set up, the video gives us just the view of a dresser and door, with enough odd decorations present to make anyone feel uncomfortable. An ersatz clock is present on the door before it seemingly goes haywire all by itself. The clock hands spin out of control and the clock itself falls off the door. We're left with a video of a cane and what appears to be a picture of Jesus, any poltergeist's worst enemy. Clothes seem to fly up and out of the dresser all by themselves, all punctuated by what can only be described as odd hiccuping noises. This is all before the picture of Jesus begins to bleed. Whatever explanation for this video exists, it certainly does a great job of creeping us out. Harkening back to old Poltergeist videos, this video makes us feel just as weirded out as we did the first time we watched The Exorcist or The Poltergeist. One gets the feeling that there's a malevolent spirit at play here, and whatever its intention, it couldn't possibly be in the best interests of these homeowners. This bizarre video, which was uploaded by Mysterio Canal, seems to show what can only be described as a figure on fire in the distance. Slowing the video down and replaying it while focusing on the figure in the distance, one gets chills. There isn't much else it could be. It's a person on fire walking alone on a dusty old road. The video's uploaders beg the question, was this truly a witch walking alongside the road? While the video is dark and the figure can't be made out clearly, it seems as though there's no other explanation. Otherwise, we want to know, how was this figure in flames walking around so casually? Perhaps more importantly, is the figure benevolent or something to be feared? The questions we're left with after watching this make it truly one of the eeriest videos on the internet. Such inexplicable phenomena seem to be what the internet and viral videos have based their entire existence off. But sometimes all it takes is a less flashy video to make it one that really sticks with viewers. Regardless of what the figure is, the seeming inability to grasp what actually is happening in front of the videographers will stick with us viewers for quite some time. This chilling CCTV footage uploaded to Reddit is one of the most creepy videos on the internet because it provides us with a clear video of something we simply can't explain. In the video, we see a woman heading down some stairs. As she nears the bottom, we see what appears to be a formless shadowy figure appearing in the bottom left hand corner. It's evident that the woman sees it too, as she turns around and heads back up the stairs as quickly as she had been heading down them. This video gets creepier and creepier the more you watch it, as it's more and more apparent each time you look that there's no figure there. What's more, the woman's speed at the beginning of the video, coupled with how quickly she turned away from the shadow, seems to imply that she had already seen it. Was the shadow the thing that drove her down the stairs in the first place? Had it mysteriously appeared at the bottom of the stairs, or were there multiple shadows? In either case, we can't be sure the fate this woman suffered was a kind one. What do you think this video shows? Love to get your opinions in the comments section below.
before we get to that number one spot and take a look at some stunning footage of an alleged giant walking in the mountains of Peru, remember to hit that subscribe button and tickle the bell icon. That way you'll be in the loop about all our latest creepy content. At the height of our list of creepy videos is this seeming video of giants uploaded by Gladys Cordova, GCE Peru. At the start of the video, viewers are confronted with what appears to be normal sized individuals crouched in the distance. One of the figures then stands and it's easily apparent, even from a distance, that said figure is much, much taller than the figure standing next to it. A side by side video compares the vision captured by the video with what a normal group of people looks like in the distance and the results are chilling. Given the regular video as a comparison, the figure portrayed in the video could easily be 20, 30 feet tall and there's very little explanation. As a viewer, we can see with our own eyes the figure's outline is most likely not manipulated. This begs the question, do giants walk among us? If you can't get enough of the old slapped ham, then don't worry, we've got you covered. Check out that link on the top there. Otherwise, there's a scary playlist there you can binge on. Now, remember to follow us on all our socials as well. We're on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Links in the description box below as always. And that's it for me. I'll see you all next time. 